So this is the BMC T-Machine SLR01, the American rider TJ Van Garderen of BMC. Now, the first thing that strikes me about this bike, other than the fact that it's pretty good looking and he's got some seriously nice Tour de France edition decals on the top tube, is that it's absolutely enormous. Now, it's only a 56 frame, but look at the amount of setback that he's got on his seat. That post's got a 30 mil offset and it's rammed almost all the way back. So he's got a huge setback, but then equally, that stem at the front is a 140 minus 17. Now that's probably about as extreme as you'd ever want to go, and it's gonna be seriously compromising the handling of the bike. Now clearly, that's something that you get used to very quickly, but it is just enormous, that's an extreme position. TJ is clearly a very flexible bloke. I don't want to go too far into that, but you know, let's just leave it there. He's got some fairly stock componentry on there. They're sponsored by Shimano, so he's got the full Durace DI2 group set. But it's a very new school bike. Now, what I mean by that is that they've, BMC have clearly adopted some of the new trends that are in the Peloton. He's running 25C tubs. They've got Continental tyres on there. And they've got the Shimano Durace C50 wheels, which are really wide as well. So they support the tyre all the way around, and they're also exceedingly aerodynamic. Now the other new school touch on here is the cassette. Now TJ runs an 11 to 28 at the back. Now 28 is pretty massive and would have been unheard of in the peloton a few years ago, but now with 11 speed and equally the fact that riders are spinning more to save their legs, it's commonplace. Now as it stands, this bike's not super, super light. He's got his SRM on there as standard. He's got his massive sofa-like saddle, but for the mountains, clearly, he's going to be bang on the 6.8 kilo mark. So they will be swapping out the wheels for Shimano's C24, so really shallow and light wheels. And then I suspect there'll be one or two other adjustments as well. For record the video of the Tour de France, click AGC. What Matt's saying is for more Tour de France content, click on me. And to subscribe, click on me.